टुडे वी विल एक्सप्लेन हाउ टू फोकस द बाइल डक्ट सो दिस इज ए कंप्लीट वीडियो अनएडिटेड वीडियो सो दैट वी कैन एक्सप्लेन ऑल द इश्यूज वाइल परफॉर्मिंग द यूएस एग्जामिनेशन ऑफ द बाइल डक्ट टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिमॉन्स्ट्रेट हाउ वी इवेल्युएट द पीबीडी we are doing endoscopic ultrasound in a patient who had goldstone derange lft and ultrasound showing dilated cbd so first we go inside so here we can see the tongue we go below the tongue then we go slightly on the left side push in and then clockwise that's how we go beyond the blind area across the upper sphincter here we can see the esophagus and now we are into the stomach <laughs> so the cbd can be seen from three areas uh, one in the proximal stomach and uh, second is the first part of duodenum and third is the second part of duodenum so first we will see from the first part of first we will see from the stomach so here we can uh, on the right side is the lesser curve and on the left side is the greater curve so on the right side we can see an angle there this is the angle so here we rotate scope counter clockwise and we should be able to see the we go so this is the angle there we go inside and rotate so clockwise and we should be able to see the pancreas i'll show you again just go up across the lesser curve and on the right side we can see this angle we can appreciate this angle we go inside Step down and rotate so clockwise. <clears throat> Now this is the pancreas. So this is the pancreas and the pancreas. And this is the this is the mv this will continue as a portal vein inside the liver this is portal vein inside the liver again this is the mv portal vein below that we can see a dilated cbd the cbd can be traced inside the liver by pulling back slightly left side torque we can see here the left side it radical which are dilated then with the clockwise torque again we will and push the clockwise and push we can trace the lower cbd here we can see intrapancreatic cbd so here we can see cbd is below the portal vein and it's a dilated and we don't see any stone here and second station is the first part of duodenum we go inside go inside into the first part of duodenum and we go to the angle of duodenum between the first and second part we can see you also there so we go there and now we rotate scope anti clockwise once we rotate scope anti clockwise we can see two structures is the so this is the portal vein that's the hepatic artery and that's the could be the bile duct so when when we rotate so anti clockwise we can see the structure is dividing this is dividing this is the bile duct so when we drop our left hand we can see we can trace it into the liver and when we rotate so clockwise we can trace it down so when we trace it down it goes towards the pancreas and we can see a 
so on there we can appreciate it so on there so from the first part of duodenum we can see majority of cbd here we can see a stone which is measuring the 10 mm so again <laughs> if i rotate scope anti clockwise i'm dropping my left hand we can trace the bile duct into the liver and we can see this duct is dividing so it's a bile duct and if we rotate scope clockwise and slightly push inside raising our left hand so we should be able to trace the duct towards the ampulla so this is the lower end and here we can see also the pancreatic duct so that duct is the bile duct and that duct is the pancreatic duct left side dropping left hand will go towards the liver hilum and raising the right left hand will go towards the ampulla okay dropping left hand we should be able to go inside the <coughs> liver we are going in the liver and if we want to see gall bladder the movement should be down and left and counter clockwise so what we will do we go into the first part of duodenum drop the left hand and anti and the up down no should be down And the left rope should be left. So, this is scan. Oh yeah, so this is the gallbladder. So normally the movement is down, left, and then left rope, left. So here we can see this is the gall bladder and we can see one in the gall bladder also so the movement for again i repeat we we'll go inside into the duodenum so this is the bile duct normally the movement for gall bladder is anti clockwise but in this patient we are getting gall bladder clockwise star position of gall bladder is variable but mostly the movement is dropping the left hand left lobe left and the up down lobe down but in this patient we are getting the gall bladder at the slight clock five star so this is the gall bladder kitchen and next station is the second part of duodenum so we shorten it from the first part of duodenum we see the roof localize the roof and gradually shorten it so we have shortened the scope now we'll suck all the air if i rotate with the shaft anti clockwise I should see the left kidney. we go inside and give us proper start and we we'll start in the we see a large vessel there Okay. 
So we can see arterial flow there. This is iota. So once we see iota, so once we see iota, we pull back and rotate clockwise. Here we see two ducts. One is the pancreatic duct. The duct which is rising towards the papilla is the pancreatic duct. So if we rotate scope anti-clockwise on the pancreatic duct, we see other ducts. That's a bile duct. That's the bile duct, and we can see the stone in the bile duct. So the CBD can be seen from the proximal stomach, first part of duodenum, and second part of duodenum. That completes the examination of CBD, and we can see one stone in the bile duct. 